Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to continue working on part 2 of this cabin. Let's get started. So in the previous video, we already started with our model. Um, we have our exterior and interior wall. And we added a powder room here with a closet as well. The next thing I'm, I want to concentrate is by adding the stairs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to architecture and then click on stairs. You want to make sure that your base level is level 1 and then going to level 2. What I plan here is by adding an L-shape um, stairs. So we're going to add in around 5 and then a landing and then the rest will be the remaining so let's add in five so once you click it here it you will be able to see how many you put and how many is remaining by looking at below here so here i am added three four and five after that I'm going to skip because I want the landing right here. So I'm just going to add it right here and then just pull it all the way up. I know that 17 will be perfect for this. So I'm just going to click on finish. And then once we're finished, we will be able to select everything and then move it accordingly. So as you can see, it's easier to move it right now once you click on finish. And then if you're planning to edit your stairs, you could just edit and click it right here. Okay, so we, we've done our stairs. And then now what we could do is we could add in our kitchen and then our living room right here. And then we have some entrance right here. Um, we could put in... Um, some some dining room right here as well and then we could uh, add another um, like a sitting cushions right here so a couch something like that so let's go to insert and add in some furniture so go back to the main and then click on furniture and then here we could add in some seating let's use this chair open and then type in cm and let's add it right here two of them side by side we could just move it all the way to the wall and then let's load more we could add into the sofa and then let's type in cm again and then let's add it right here so we have our chairs and our sofa and then after that we should load more we can load in the tables we could add in the coffee table type in cm put it in the middle and then we could change this to a different size we could use this and then just change it a bit so we could click on edit duplicate uh, for the name you can just put different kinds so I'm just gonna put it um, edited coffee table and then after that what I'm gonna change is the length I think that's not good enough so I'm gonna change it more 
around 1500 and then the width is probably around 700 let's change this to 1400 and let's see how it looks so i think that's about as perfect as it could be uh, for the the depth of this as well we should change this so the depth should be around 550 and then here as well let's edit this to 550 So that's good enough. We can now turn it around. Okay, so that's perfect for this area now. We could add in more here by typing on CS. So you could basically click this CS that's create similar. You'll be able to drag it again and then as you can see we can just add in a sofa here as well we can move this one right about there and for this one this okay, i'm just gonna leave that and then this will be the entrance so that's why we're adding we could basically add just the chair here so cs that okay so let's add this one right here and then we have our entrance right here and then we could add more Let's use some nightstand table and then CM. Let's add it on this corner and then we could add it on this corner as well. And then we could just move them both so that the spacing is perfect. Okay. And then we could add in some lamp there later on. And then here we could add in a fireplace. So depending on how it looks like. Um, next thing we're gonna do is we're, we could start on, yeah, we could start on the fireplace actually. So also here, I'm just gonna type this one CS and then add it here as well. We might delete that later, but depending on the spacing here but so far there's a lot of spacing so you can see you can just go here go straight after here and then actually we still need to add in the dining right here so we need a dining table we could use this oval and then type in cm and then let's add it right here Let's, you, let's add in the chairs as well. So go back to furniture and then seating. And let's add the bower. CM again to add. Let's add right here. And right here. And then another one right here and then we could basically just mirror that so that everything will be centered and then this one as well just use mirror draw axis like that let's add in some lighting so we need to go back to the main 
and then lighting, architecture, internal, and then let's add in the table lamp, which is this one, would be good, CM, and then make sure that your elevation is around 700 so that it will appear on the top add it right here as well and then here press escape and escape again okay and then we could actually put no, I think this is better for the entrance right here. And then we will have this big um, window right here. And then we will have the fireplace right here. What I'm planning to do is I'm going to click on the wall, edit type, duplicate. This will be fireplace, firewall or fireplace would be good, good uh, name and then here let's change this to a uh, stone so we should go to stone and then let's just use this one for now a slate apply okay and then for the thickness I want to make sure to just put 200 and then after that we need to put in rectangle let's add it right here I know there's it's gonna be like that but we need to put it some somewhere like here and then we need to edit so SL and then now we need to just pull this out like that if we see it on 3d it will look like that for now but we need to extend that later on so probably where we need to extend it all the way to level level 3 or all the way up there so we might change the height later on but i just want to point out that it will be looking like that we will have an a-frame uh, roof so that will be it i'm just looking at the way this one stacked so we could have this one this wall will be all glass 